this. We have our launch happening right now, Ooh. liquid pump. So uh, 10 so grams of uh, glycerol and two grams of arginine uh, nitrates. So this is a stem-free pump. This is on the site right now. Buy one, get one 50% off. All pre-workouts actually, so prevail everything. And that includes these, this uh, L-carnitine. I'm taking a little bit before I do this little walk, but. Yeah, so we just, dude, this has been ongoing, this product, forever. So is this like the... Um, it's, it's, it's a liquid version uh, yeah. of Amplify. Right? But, yeah, okay. So it's like hydration, but we have glycerol is the base of this. Okay, okay. Let's liquid to... delivery is like the new thing now. It's I mean, quick, huh? Yes. Yeah. So a lot of people, and of course, the stim-free. The stim-free has really taken off now. Yeah. Uh, and you know... Uh, I'm as we get older, man, like we're not taking the crazy yeah. caffeine, right? Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, so awesome. crazy schedule coming up, guys. I want to talk a little bit before we start walking. Uh, Canada, I'm going to be in Toronto, Oakville, and then Vancouver the next day, 16th and 17th, Supplement World, uh, Canada. So make sure you guys check that out if you guys are in that area. It's been a long time since I've been in Toronto, man. Val's going to be happy to see you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> see him. So I'm going to fly in and uh, pop in, do that event. I'm gonna try to go train at Dorian's gym oh, also yeah. at some point. Uh, pure, mus pure muscle and fitness, yeah. yeah. I heard it's great. Yeah, I wanna see it. I just saw Aaron Banks was up there training there. And, nice. um, and then uh, we have uh, also the, I'm gonna be in UK for the Young LA event, which is gonna be on the 23rd. So we'll be announcing that soon. Why, they have, why are they going to the UK for that? Black UK? Friday, they did a big, they're doing a big launch for Black Friday. This is actually one of the, nice. one of the early uh, previews really? of this. So we're gonna have like a meet and greet set up there on the 23rd, it's in London. So I'm pretty excited about that. Wow. Do you have any other gigs in London or just that? No, nah, just that. Just I'll be out there for that. So we'll have to stay tuned, so. Does Zach know you're coming? I didn't tell him yet. Okay. Maybe he'll, he'll watch this. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think, Misty? You want to go for a walk? Huh? He got a haircut yesterday. What do you think? He looks good. He always he's got looks his good. Little, uh, he's got his little handkerchief on. You ready to go for a walk? So we're going to go outside? Is he going to put on his jacket soon? Because it's getting cold I in know, the morning. I know, I know. You know what? I had his jacket here. I think she took it, though. I think it was like 37 when I woke up today. Huh? I think it was like 37 when I woke up today. Daisy's got hers on. <laughs> she's, Look always, at, she's got her little, she's got a hoodie on. She's always cold. Let me grab a jacket for him. Yeah, and and uh, we'll see what. Uh, oh, Daisy. Let me see what. Uh, oh, here it is right here. I found you know, his. Good. Okay, come on, mister. <laughs> Let's put on your little jacket. Come on. <laughs> come here. Look at he. he, he gets... <laughs> okay, come on. Come on. Let's put on your little jacket. He, <laughs> he needs it, huh, Dave? <laughs> oh, yeah. Huh? Yeah, he has no hair. <laughs> He's cut short. Angie's better at putting this on. Hold on. <laughs> you know how the males are putting their... I know. It's like, it's like changing diapers, dude. <laughs> awkward. <laughs> huh? It's awkward. <laughs> yeah. Huh. I'm going to put your little sweater on. Even you're saying that, so I know if I walked out there... Yeah. Angie would get mad if uh without his jacket? Yeah. Uh. Hey Daisy. Oh, he looks good. You wanna come with daddy, huh? All right. He's even got style. It's Balenciaga. Look, oh. he, that's not that's actually getting a lot of uh bad publicity, I think. Yeah. Okay, you ready? All right. All right, we're gonna go for walks. All come right. on. Then, uh, <laughs> in a sweatshirt, does that make any sense to you? Or well, it's you're, not too yeah, I mean, too you're, bad. In a, you're in a hoodie and yeah, yeah, I'm bundled up. You're always cold, huh? Yeah. But uh, I was actually when I when I saw on the phone, it was like, oh, 37 this morning. I got out. I was like, oh, it doesn't seem so cold. Well, the sun's out, right? Yeah. Yeah, 37, man. You never think that the desert. Everyone's. I was just traveling in. in in Boston, you know, we had a great show out there. We did the yeah the New Englands, and everyone's like, "Oh, Vegas must be hot, right?" And I'm like, "Actually, actually, warmer there. It was like 80 when I was there. Wow, most of the days." I talked to Steve yesterday. He told me it was 78 in New York. Wow, that's nice. And I said, "Man, you guys are warmer than we are." Yeah, 
That's true. The weather here is is. It, it turned. Co- I don't. I don't remember it being this cold uh, this time of year. No, I think it's colder earlier. But I remember the last year, last winter was pretty cold. Like when it was in in the middle of it, you know, it was pretty cold. Yeah, just th- that's what I always tell everyone. The weather can change rather quickly. Yeah, it did. Because not too long ago, we still had like a hundred uh, uh, degrees outside. Yeah, I feel like it cooled down uh, pretty decently. I mean, the summer yeah. was probably a hardest one, hottest one yet, you know. But didn't you say as we get older, we seem to be like feeling the summer more? You said that actually a while ago. Remember, we were moving out of Angie, and you're like, "Man, I used to be a to- I used to be able to tolerate the summer." You know what I think it is, Dave? Is that I, 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 I'm not going to lie. I think I. I picked, I chose kind of when I would leave the house because I was only training. Yeah. But I think now with, with running business and moving during the day on a, on a more open schedule, I feel like, uh, you know, when you're out and about more. That makes sense. You know, people always talk about this global warming thing, and I don't even know if that's a real thing or not, but I think it's, it's uh we definitely don't get as much snow in the east coast i mean talking to my family and everyone out oh in the east coast it really? doesn't seem like they get do you remember the blizzards and all oh, that hell stuff? Yeah. i mean i sure remember that yeah man that was dude always... that would paralyze the city for like two three days back in the day yeah so bad i mean montreal was pretty heavy we liked it because we didn't have to go to school <laughs> It did a snowmobile out. That was funny. So funny. That's the only thing we cared about when it, <laughs> yeah. when it would snow is, uh, can we get canceled at school, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, come on. Snow day. Come on, let's go. Yep. But I remember those. So what's going on with the gym culture in Vegas? Well, everything's kind of back to normal now, you know, after the... How crazy was the Dragon's Lair during the Olympia? Uh, you know what? It was crazy. But not as crazy as it was two years ago. So do you think that there was less people at the Olympia or less people no. in the gym? I think I think because people are really aware of all the gyms that you can actually go to to Vegas, it was more spread out between all the locations. Do you That's... see this? Do you remember I was talking oh, about yeah. this? Now yeah. the lot's back for sale. They want 400000 for it now. It was three hundred before. Is this is this just as big as yours? Uh, it's just awkward because it has that. Yeah. But they want more money for it now. It's a hundred grand more than when I, I, they, I made them an offer, but it was less than what they were asking before. They're still asking too high for it, but. Really? Yeah. Yeah, that may. We talked about buying it, make it into a park and all that stuff, you know. All that stuff may come down soon. Let's hope. Yeah. You know, real estate, all that stuff. Um, so. Do you think it was, the, but you think that because of the gyms being spread out yeah, now? Yeah, yeah. Because I saw torture got a lot of, a lot of people went to okay. torture. A lot of pros. Like, I know well, they were, they were supposedly the official gym of the Olympia, I yes, believe. They have yes. that signage there. Yes. But I feel like the new tech equipment's getting a lot of attention. Don't yes. you feel that way? Plus, they were like a major sponsor of the show That's also. True. That's true. Yeah, Mr. BN was, um, yeah. they brought him on stage and all that. So this weekend, you know, Saturday is the re-grand opening of Strength Culture, oh, which is the old elevation. That's right. They changed the name, huh? Yeah, it's on Saturday. Oh, this, okay. This Saturday. So this will launch out, I believe. I mean, today's Friday, but... Yeah, well, I can't work on it like today. Yeah. Tonight. We want it, We probably want to launch it. Yeah. So t- you'll be guys who will be getting this. Uh, I think we're going to launch it tomorrow morning. Yeah, yeah. I see you finished the Sergio video, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we... Uh, what did he predict for his, uh, his competition season for 2025? So, see, he's just, he had to change coach, you know. He, he's not with Chris anymore, which was a really yeah, good Yeah, I know, but he was him. with Neil Hill. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, no. I so don't know. So is he doing it on his own now, or is he... No, he's him? got a new guy, but he's going to announce who it is. Oh, he hasn't yeah. said. Okay. No. Yeah. Yeah. So he's been looking and... How big is he now? He's huge. Yeah, he's always in... He always says that he's not that big. You know, like, dude, you can, <laughs> there's an issue in your head. Did I, ever say, did I ever say I wasn't big? No. He's somehow, he's... Uh, but at least now, 
everything is really clicking. His shoulder is better, yeah. like everything is better. So he's really happy. So it's nice, you know, he's in a good place it, mentally. You know, I was looking on YouTube last night and I was going back on all our JTV videos. And yeah. I don't think there were ones that you filmed. I think it was when Brian was actually filming. Oh, well, you went way Bro, back. I can't believe how big I was. You were. You're massive, dude. Crazy, right? Yeah. I, I can't even believe sometimes looking at some of these pictures. And I, <laughs> you know, it's like watching myself do some of these weights and I'm like, man, how did I get under those weights? <sighs> yeah. It's crazy, That's crazy for me. It's fun to look back sometimes. Yeah, I saw a picture of Dexter Jackson and he posted the other day in Gold's Venice and I was like, man, I commented on it. I said, he was so big during I know. those times he was spending out there. And, yeah. And, uh, you know, I got to go shoot for the, I was shooting some Black Friday stuff with the collaboration with Gold's Gym. Oh, okay. We're doing a collab with Young LA. Nice. And, uh, I got to train in the Mecca and, and. Uh, Were they glad to see you, Jeff? Yeah, and yeah. And it was, it was, it was late at night. Oh, nobody's there. Wow. Just nobody's like the there. old days. Yeah, I was there, you know, and you see, I see all these people because I left about, I think I, I think the, I think it started at six, uh, and it started at uh, like seven. So I, I did see some of the old crowd. Yeah. There. What did so they close at eleven morning? now though? Oh, is that it? Yeah, they close at eleven. They don't close at midnight anymore. I thought, it, I thought it was even like one o'clock. No, I think ever since um oh, pandemic, wow. they changed the hours. Okay. Yeah. Well, I guess it's late enough. 11. Hmm. Yeah, look, this dog wants to play with Capone. He's, ah. he's always looking for friends, dude. You know that. Yeah. When we were in Boston, there was a woman walking her dog, and, you know, they have a little park across the street from the hotel, and he, uh, you know, he wants to go up to every dog. She's like, oh, my dog's not friendly. <laughs> so we, he was disappointed, you know, because he still was, like, sniffing and, like, trying to... <laughs> He's so friendly all the time. How was uh, how was Halloween back? Halloween home? was great, man. We went to Salem. Yeah. Uh, we went to Salem on Halloween. It was crazy. Yeah. So many fans too. Oh really? Yeah, tons of people stopped me to take pictures, and everyone wow. was all dressed up, and they had like a band playing at the end of the street. And Did you dress up or? No, no, no. We just but we went by the like the Hocus Pocus house, and then we went to. Uh, we saw. Um, the witch's house, which okay. is pretty pretty popular for there. You guys that fall, you know that Salem's like goes all out. Yeah. But the only disappointing thing we didn't get to go to, like Spooky World or Witch's Woods, which we normally do because we just by the time we got in, we only had one day before Halloween, and we had to get ready for the show. So okay, come, uh, on, yeah. come on. He loves teasing these. Guys. This is like a tradition for you, huh? Every year. Well, you, go. you know, we started dating eight years. Like we kind of officially, not even not even eight years ago now, but we started to kind of see each other. I flew her. I went on tour to Middle East just before my show, and I ended up landing in Boston straight from the Middle East after being gone three weeks. Wow! And I flew her out to hang out with me, and that's when we kind of firstly. She, I didn't realize she loved Halloween so much. Yeah. And she's always talked about Salem and. Dude, I lived there for 25 years of my life. Wow. And never went to Salem ever. Oh, wow. Yeah, I never went to these places. So when we went, which we've been a few times, we just never went on Halloween. She was like so excited about it. She knew all the history, you know? Oh, wow. And I don't really know about like the Hocus Pocus house and all yeah. that. I never really watched the, the movie. She's a big fan. Yeah. Okay. So it was pretty cool. I nice. thought it was neat. And, uh, you know, of course, the show was around there. We had. We had a great comp competition there. Always. Tons of people came out. You know, Steve Cardillo came, you know, oh. which was awesome. He never comes to the shows. Nice. They make belts for us for the overall winners, yeah. too. But uh, in ANC, Pete out there. But Steve came, man, which was the first time ever he's come to wow. the show. And it was nice to see him. And, and uh, you know, of course, Nate at Gym Hub and all that. It was awesome. Saw Jose. Oh, how's he doing? Out there. Jose's great. The Jose's Muffin good, man. yeah. <laughs> Muffin man. He was at the Olympia. <laughs> you didn't see him at the Olympia, did you? No. Yeah. I miss him. Yeah, so that's it, man. We're just, uh, 
you know, we're just uh, cruising along, and it's been a minute since we did a jaywalk. So yeah. So hopefully this will be launched on Saturday yep. tomorrow. Yeah, it'll be ready today. And, uh, you know, once again, guys, um, let me know what's going on. Let me know what's going on in the comments. And uh, How was your Halloween? <laughs> yeah, how was the Halloween? And, uh, you know, we're happy the election's over now. We're oh, very yes, happy. Now, yes, yes. now we can uh, yeah. kind of get back to business Go a little bit. Go back to normal. Yeah. Um, you know, it's been crazy advertising on like all the, every time I turned on my YouTube, did you get this every time it was like a political ad? Nonstop. And, yeah. uh, Too you much. know, I think it, it kind of, you know, the media, I think really separates a lot of people. And I, hopefully now people can kind of, yeah. you know, hash everything aside and, yeah, yeah. you know, in the next four years, um, just you know, under the Trump organization and just you know, be positive about it, keep living our thing, and hopefully the economy gets a little better now. And, yes, please. And, uh, you know, everyone can uh, come, come together, you know. So yes. let's uh, let's keep crushing it, guys, and we'll be back for another Jaywalk, and Dave and I are out. Right, Mercy thanks. for you. No worries for you. That Game of Thrones. Go sexy on you. I kept the script. I rolled the dice. Don't fall asleep, because I'm working nights. Hey, you trying to show...